to Iraq, the war would have been over here. I wish I, I wish I, it may be true, but I'll tell you this, uh, Jim Webb's son just came back, he's a Marine, we just had him visit us in our caucus the other day, and uh, he's going back probably. Uh, Tim Johnson's son sort of over there in the 101st Air War, and both of them have had the kind of sort of search for responsibility that I've just articulated. And they're not for just leaving their son's effort in the chaos of abandonment. That's not what they're for. So you've got to, you know, you've got to work through this with some of these folks in a way that comes up with a coaching policy. And as I said to all of you before, folks, I, there's a, there's a difference between what you can achieve as president, obviously, and what you can achieve in the Congress when you require 67 votes and 60 votes to get anything done. There just is a difference. And also, when you have a filibuster, and they'll just talk it on. And you can't even get a vote. And you can't get a vote on some of this. So we're going to revisit this issue. This will be on the floor within the next weeks. I don't know now because of the immigration bill coming back, whether it's been pushed back uh, a couple of weeks as a result of the immigration bill. We were slated to take up a